There you go. So week 312 of Lick Friday. That is your lick. And um, I like that kind of lick because it's got repetitions, really kind of aggressive vibrato, although not Zach Wilde stakes vibrato, but um, with a little bit of melody kind of involved and it's just like pentatonic scale. So you can't go wrong. It's using shape one, pentatonics, you've got vibrato, you've got everything in there, technique wise pull offs and that repetition, which is what bring, brings the sort of blues and rock riffs into their own kind of zone. So if you want the tab, it's on my website, dansguitar.com. If you want the jamming track, the full jamming track that is, you can go to my Patreon page, patreon.com forward slash Dan's page, all linked up there and down below, and go to the Jam Zone tier system where there are now over like 23, 24 tracks on there. Um, so I've been doing that for two years, I think, roughly, of, of jamming tracks. Um, which you'll find on there and you can download it and do what you like with it so there you go and um, if you want the jamming track as a smaller little taster version just wait until the end of the video so it's all there free for you to use now so there you go um, right let's get on with that breakdown but before I do that actually please do consider liking the video subscribing it hitting that bell button and tag in hashtag Lick Friday on all your social media stuff because if you like these videos why not share them there you go eh right see you in a little minute for the breakdown so it is a fairly straightforward lick on this one um just using the pentatonic scale it's all about the the the, the sort of like expression within so the, the bend initial bend on that 15th fret on the second string sorry it's getting that emotion across so you're really digging in as you pick and it's the 15th fret full tone bend it's kind of slowish on the first one, but then the second one is quick with vibrato. Okay, so that's twice on that. Then you've got... And again, you're sort of not holding back whilst picking the strings. Digging in because you need the, the lick to pop and you need it to sort of come out from the mix. Um, so you've got 12 first string, 15 pull off to the 12 on the second string. And then 15, 12 pull off again to the 14 on the third string and then the 12 on that third string as well with again nice wide vibrato. If you're not used to vibrato it's basically all from the wrist so don't use your fingers to do that because obviously you're going to end up with tendon problems which is not fun. So when you're vibrato in or bending you're moving your wrist like that anyway little little tip on that there is a video on vibrato for you guys to watch on my channel so please feel free to watch that if you like um, then you've got one of my favorite types of licks which is a reoccurring one where you got and you're playing it twice and again you're digging into the notes to make them pop and make them sing so that lick is third fret start 12th fret hammer on to the 14 to the 12 on the second string, 14 pull off to 12 this time, so, and then the 14 on the fourth string to finish that lick, and you play it twice. And then the last part of the lick is purely and simply, and then slide it out, which is the 12th fret blues curl the 14th fret on the D string and then you're going to vibrato that and then slide that out so the blues curl basically is where you're holding the note I've mentioned this many times before but for those that are new and are not sure it's where you're holding that note as long as you can kind of almost starting to bend it and as soon as you're just about to come away from that note you sort of almost hook it just before you come off to the next note and that is a blues curl basically so it's a very very small bend right at that last moment that you're just about to finish playing that note there you go so i'll play the lick slow for you now and it goes three four and one So the end of the video once more, so that's 312 done, 312 licks for you guys to learn and hopefully, I can't remember, but I think they're all different 
um, which is, yeah, quite kind of crazy, really. Um, so there you are. So you've got 312 weeks of lessons to go through, which in turn, as a little favour from you to me, um, for these weekly me to you lessons, please do hit that subscribe button, bell button, thumbs up, and share these videos on your social medias, Instagram and stories and all that sort of stuff, Facebook, with the hashtag seven, uh, seven riffs as well, but hashtags uh, lick Friday, which would be amazing because I need the, these videos to be pushed along. More people should be learning them. So I will leave you with that thought and I will bid you farewell, but remember the jamming track is coming up and uh, you can get it on the Patreon page along with the tab, free tab, on my website, dansguitar.com. So there you are. See you all next week for week 313. Whichever way you look at it, it's still the same, isn't it? Backwards or forwards. Nice. See you later, everyone. Bye.